Look at this guy just waiting. He says, well, you've come out. Come on over. Taking a break here with Zeus. Um, it's been a very busy day. Got all kinds of stuff done. So I'll talk about just a few minutes. But I wanted to cover something really important that I'm going to put up pretty fast here. And that has to do with comments uh, on this channel. For the most part, everybody is fantastic. I want to thank everybody who comes in and is encouraging and supportive. What are you bargain at? He's got something. What do you got? What is it? Um, encouraging and supportive and positive and you know, all kinds of really good things. Once in a while, once in a blue moon, somebody comes in and they're, they're not. And I had to, after, it's a pretty hot day today, I've been pretty busy, and come in and see this comment from a repeat commenter that I've seen a couple times. And I've said, please don't comment like this. And um, essentially, I want to communicate that everybody who comes to this community, uh, and wants to participate um, by commenting or uh, making suggestions, you know, whatever it is, providing encouragement or telling us, all of us, stories about what you're up to, what you've done, how you've done it, things like that. It is absolutely safe to do so. And I feel like I need to say that because once in a while, people, other people will come in and, and, and to, I mean, any YouTube channel or any online system and they'll, kind of rough up those people and tell them they're doing something wrong. And once in a while I get it. Like I said, once every couple of months I'll hear something about what I do. And I can handle it. I don't have any... What? I don't have any uh, any real problem. I mean, I'm human too, but... Um, I want both people who want to share stuff here, people who want to... Uh, tell stories and brag about what they're up to to know that it, it might sound odd but you're under my protection is my channel my, I have control over it if I see somebody coming in and they're being unkind disrespectful rude or even aggressive or attacking uh, they will be warned hopefully <laughs> if it's bad enough I just straight out delete and ban those people um, now the band stick doesn't come out very often, but once in a while it comes out. Uh, and I want both you, th those that want to share, those that are encouraging, those that are supportive, those that make suggestions, uh, to feel that comfort. And I want those that are coming in here to, uh, I mean, in their mind, maybe they're not being aggressive, but it feels that way. And so I'd say, my final suggestion is anybody who wants to comment, anybody who wants to say something here, keep in mind you're talking to another human being. If you think they are below your IQ level, underneath the knowledge level that you have, not as wise as you are, don't have as much experience as you have, that's fine. Think as you will, but be kind, be respectful, because I just won't tolerate anything different around here um, it's it's not the type of community we want to build here it's not the type of people that are surrounded in here it's not the type of people that um, have become a huge part of this community uh, here on this channel um, to be supportive encouraging positive uh, and and fun <laughs> a lot of great jokes and oh squirrel check it out Gonna go. No jokes about the squirrel thing either, okay? Honestly, they're adorable. Anyhow, um, it's very important to me. It's very important to me as just a provider of videos and being part of this. It's very important to me as a person. Um, I want everybody to consider, I look at every comment and I want you to think that my daughter, my little 10 year old, looks at every comment too. And she is going to learn one thing or another. So for the most part, 95% of the time, she learns that people are amazing. 
That's right, all of you guys who are commenting and saying jokes and having fun and saying how much you love the horses and saying how much you feel better uh, being at peace here. She gets to read, she doesn't read all of them, obviously, just a few. But when she sees those, she gets to learn from them. But I also teach her about those that aren't kind, whether I respond to them or just ban them. Um, and I really want everybody to be, as a commenter, you are going to be a teacher as well. And to those who come further into this community and start reading through comments, how to be towards people, how to be towards others who are learning, who are uh, uh, new to the horse world. Maybe they don't know things. So please consider that in the future when commenting, posting things, um, it's important to me. And uh, on a very positive note, uh, I worked with this guy in the trailer. So I'm going to put those videos, I have two videos right after this one. And you guys can see how he did. All right. So that's it for now. Uh, we'll see you guys in the next video, which uh, will hopefully be tomorrow. So thanks for watching. Mm, we got the front feet so far. So he's a little bit of trailer training day. It's definitely a no funsies job. It's one of those jobs you get into. You think, well, it's like pressure washing. It takes as long as it takes. But we got the front feet. I might quit on this. It's been about an hour, I think, we've worked at this. Having him just stand, chill out. <laughs> Trailer training is definitely about patience. Having more than uh, the horse does for not wanting to come in, kind of thing. Anyways, we're we're part way in, <laughs> so we might continue this another time. See how he does. He's just standing here quietly. So it's good. And uh, we'll see. See what the next one looks like today or maybe tomorrow. Well, two minutes after that video, there we are. He just kind of came up. I didn't think he would. We've been in a long time with those front two feet. And sometimes it works like that. You get to where you you get those front feet to come in and sometimes they'll want to just take off and leave you and they don't want anything to do with you again they want to get out and leave and then other times they're like well i guess i'll come hang around with you a little in the trailer so here i'm going to try to drop the rope looks like a snake and uh we'll pat him oh sell good boy well yeah. so there you go try the training A little and then we'll continue doing this probably every day for a week till he just hops right in and that's about it <laughs>